Nana Jiri is a major pilgrimage site for Jainism in India. It is located in the central Indian state of Madhya Pradesh, it is 12 kilometers from Dalpatpur and 25 kilometers from Buxwaha. This Tirtha, also known as Rishanda Jiri, is a Siddha Kshetra where five ancient saints including Bharadatta had attained Nirvana. According to ancient Nirvanakanda text. Translation, here at Rishanda Jiri, the Sambo Sharana of Lord Parshvanath had come in Bharadatta etc. Five Munis had attained Nirvana. We bow to them. Similar mentions are made in Hindi Nirvana Kanda, 1684 AD, of B. Al Bhagavadadas, an 1882 Marathi text of Bhadaraka Devendra Kurti of Karunja. Nayanjiri Tirth Kshetra includes a temple complex on the hill, two temples besides a lake, temples in the valley, and a nearby Siddhashila. The main temple complex is situated on a low hill, with 36 Jain temples on hill, and 15 in valley. The Jay Lamander Temple is in the middle of a pond with a mana stand but in the front. There is also a Sambo Sharana Mandar on the other side of the pond. All the Jain temples on hill are surrounded by a wall. The oldest temple, termed Bara Mandar, which is the 11th temple, was unearthed a few centuries ago. According to an inscription of the temple, the year of completion was VS 1109, 1053 AD. The principal deity of this temple is Lord Parsvanatha in Kaitsarga 4 feet 7 inches high. This was installed in VS 2015, 1959 AD. A beautiful and artistic Gamada Yaksha and Yakshini Ambika idol is also present here, with a Yakshini with a child in her lap. The Parshvanath Temple, Shavizi Mandar, is the largest temple with a 16-foot-tall idol of Lord Parshvanath of 1953 AD, along with images of the 24 Tirthankaras and the images of the five Munis who attained Moksha here. The picturesque Chalmander of Nainajiri was featured on the 2002 Jaina calendar. Recently a tall Manistanbo was erected in front of it. The grand circular Sambo Sharana Mandar features paintings of famous Tirthas. Near the temple complex, there is a large rock and river Bibas termed Sadashila. It is said that on this rock Bardata etc. minis attain Nirvana. There is also an ancient altar about a mile from the Tirtha. The rock has many prehistorical petroglyphs. An old Dharmashala building built by Shabaram Malaya now houses an extensive library called Acharya Devanandi DJ Svadhaya Avam Shoda Sansdan. It also houses rare handwritten manuscripts. There are facilities for scholars to state. Nearby Singhai Sadish Chandra Keshar Devi Higher Secondary School provides education to the local children. A number of temples have images installed in VS 1943 to 1948, 1886 to 1892 AD. This was the time when Nainajiri emerged a major Tirtha. In VS 1943, AD 1886, a large Pranishta function with three separate Gajarath chariots was organized, where one lakh, 100,000, Jains are said to have attended. In 1833 AD, Bhadaraka Shurendra Kurti of Gwalior had visited the Tirtha while traveling to Shravana Belgala. He arrived from Dronagar and then proceeded to Kundalpur. The Tirtha was often visited by Chalaka Gangeprais at Varni. In 1919, a convention was organized that inaugurated the Bharat Varshi at Galapurva de Gumbar Jain Sava under his leadership. Acharya Vidyasagar visited the Tirtha, a spot where he took a hara, food offered by Shravakas, and recovered from a serious ailment in 1978, is marked and is revered by the pilgrims. He stayed here during his chanturmas in 1978, 1981, and 1982, and also visited it at other times. He had given Diksha to 72 Munis and Arikas here. Acharyas Vishuddha Sagar and Vibhava Sagar have also been present on special events. Baba Daltaran Varni had established a patchalan here in 1902, which was among the earliest in the Bundelkhand region. He wrote several books here including a basha, translation slash commentary, of Gamat Sarja Vakanda in 1904. The manuscript was reported as having been lost by Gange Pras at Varni, however recently Suresh Jain has located the manuscripts and is being published. A memorial marking his samadhi in 1908 is present just outside the compound. Famous Jain scholar Dr. Darbari Lal Kothia was born here. There are three Dharmashalas with the overall capacity of 1,000. There is a Bojanalaya. There are facilities for visiting monks and scholars and a research library. The place is located in Tilhsil Bukhasmahat, District, Shatarpur, Madhya Pradesh.
It is 13 kilometers from Dalpatpur located on the Sagar Kanpur National Highway 86. Nearest bus stand Dalpatpur 13 km Bukhusmaha 25 kilometers. Nearest railway station Sagar 58 kilometers.